Hello, I'm Richard Ridge for Broadway World. Broadway is back. The global phenomenon, Sixth the Musical, which was supposed to open on March 12, 18 months ago, and then Broadway shut down. They're finally going to have their official opening night on October 3rd. And I'm here with two of Henry VIII's queens. They are... Abby Mueller. I'm Jane Seymour. And I'm Anna Uzele, and I play Catherine Parr. To catch up on Sixth, I am so excited to be here with the two of you. I mean, how excited are you? You're finally going to open on Broadway in six. How does it feel? Oh my gosh, it feels real good, doesn't it? Yeah. 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 This is uncharted water, so we're just enjoying yeah. every single day. Absolutely. Absolutely. I mean, Broadway is back. I mean, the streets are packed. I mean, all the lights are on. And all the, you know, you've had audiences. September 17th was your first night back on stage. Let's talk about how magical was that day? Like, what was the day like for both of you before you went on? Well, I think. I don't know about you, Anna, but I felt, I was feeling like pretty good. I was like, okay, we'll finally get, an, really excited to finally have an audience because yeah. you can only go so far, you know, yep. with your jokes, with no <laughs> audience and the creative team could only laugh so much. But then I think um, there was a lot kind of swirling about the gravitas of the day, like the first day back. And that almost put me in my head a little bit. And, and so I just kept trying to like concentrate on like the joy of it and yep. the celebration of it. And that, that helped me just be like, no, this is so cool and historical. Yeah. yeah, I was just really curious. It had been 18 months yeah. since I had been in the presence of that many people at the same time, let alone them being an actual audience there to see you. So, yeah, I didn't know what to expect. I was just really open to anything. And then walking out onto that stage, <laughs> you, you've done the show a thousand times at this point, but nothing can prepare you for like, oh, suddenly your legs are shaking and you don't know why. And suddenly your larynx is doing weird things and you can't catch your breath. And so it was just a lot of feelings all at the same time. Um, yeah, it was a wonderful night though. Because this show is like the biggest rock concert. I mean, from the second you walk into the theater, just the vibe with the audience, then the lights go down and then you're all there. So I mean, that must have been like crazy. Like you said, your legs are wobbling and everything else. Yeah, I didn't expect that. We've all performed for so long, but when you take a break, it all comes rushing back. The nerves, everything. Yeah. You have the most loyalist fans. What are the six fans called? Have you named them? Yeah. Uh, the Queendom. Yes. Oh, I like that. All right. Yes, yes. So, I mean, we were waiting to set up out here. There were some girls coming down the street, all done up in some, you know, queendom outfits, oh, okay. taking pictures outside of your theater. Yes. yes, there are some amazing cosplay situations happening. They're so fantastic. They're just so supportive. The, the fact that they've stuck by us yep. when we were on hiatus. Um, and from the very beginning, they sort of welcomed us into this whole, like, international six family. So we're so, we're so grateful. They're wild, the fans for this show. I mean, they're really, I mean, they love this show. They get all dressed up. I mean, favorite fan moment for you so far? Honestly, I think it was really meaningful during the pandemic yeah. um, to see, even though we weren't performing every single night or anything like that, how eager they were to still support us and what yeah. we were doing because we were unemployed. We didn't get a paycheck and we were struggling to live. And so just to see how willing they were to sign up for any class and support us in any way they could, like that meant so much that it was more than just six the musical. It was like they just wanted to support us as artists. Yeah. And I really appreciated that. Yeah. Yeah. So very, very, very supportive. Not yeah. just of the show, yeah. but of us. And that meant uh, absolutely a whole, whole lot. Because they're so, I mean, they give you things, they make things. I mean, you have a wild fan base. Yeah. yeah they, it, I've never, I've never experienced anything quite like it. Yeah. It's really remarkable. <laughs>